welcome back to Two Balding Nerds. This is Kellen here again. Uh, we are going to be playing a little bit of Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duel today. Uh, today we're going to be playing with Starter Deck Yugi Evolution, and George is going to be playing with Starter Deck Kaiba Evolution. And it's just kind of the same thing as last time. Uh, there's a couple of small changes to the decks just due to uh, what's on the ban list, and of course in Master Duel you can't play with banned cards. Uh, at least not yet. So, same thing as last time. Uh, we substituted Change of Heart for Brain Control. Uh, we also, again, because of Last Will, we substituted that for Call of the Haunted. For whatever reason, on Master Duel, there's no Spellbinding Circle. I don't know if this was an oversight on Konami's part, but George told me that Starter Deck Kaiba has a similar, uh, similar card that wasn't um, absent from the game called Shadow Spell. And so it has a similar effect in that you can target a face up monster your opponent controls and it cannot attack or change its battle position, but it's a little bit better because they also lose 700 attack. Um, so we changed out Spellbinding Circle for Shadow Spell. And then finally, uh, he and I came to the conclusion that because Pot of Greed is also on the Forbidden list, that we would use Shard of Greed instead. Because essentially it's Pot of Greed, it's just a bit slower to use. Uh, so we felt like that was a fair concession to make. So we're using Shard of Greed uh, in both of our decks instead of Pot of Greed. So without further ado, here is the duel and I hope you guys enjoy. Thank you for watching. Alrighty then. Coin toss. Yes, I will go second then. Oh man. Not a good start to this duel. Indeed. I'm actually surprised you didn't choose the Dark Condition as your uh, avatar. Quite honestly, I've just been a little bit lazy and I don't feel like spending my currency on stupid vanity stuff like that. Okay. Alright, let's see. What is George's first turn here? Um, you're going first. Oh, right, you chose second, my bad. Okay, yep. here we go then. Uh, we're going to start off the duel. I'm going to summon Gazelle, the king of mythical beasts, and attack him. And then I'm going to activate the Malevolent Nuzzler. Ooh. To further increase its attack to 2200. And then I will finish my turn by facing one card face down. I will end my turn. Not bad. Yeah, off to a very good start. Hmm. Wish I could say the same. <laughs> you get bricked again? <laughs> Not quite. Set one card. Oh boy. Attack if you dare, Yugi. I'm not scared of you, Kaiba! <laughs> Hope they actually do get like a Yuki and Kaiba little like icon too for the people. I would love to do that. You know what I find interesting about these starter deck uh, Yuki and Kaiba? So far, um, the Yuki one doesn't have a Mirror Force in it. The first two yeah, iterations no. didn't have mirror, mirror Force, which I find bizarre. Considering uh, it's like one of his best cards. And it doesn't also have Swords of Revealing Light either. Uh, this deck does have Swords of Revealing Light. The first one didn't. That's partly because uh, when the Star decks came out, Mirror Force came out with Feral Servant and Swords of Revealing Light came out, I think, with Magic Rulers. So they hadn't been created yet. Wait, 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 wait. Your deck has Swords of Revealing Light in it? This deck should, if I recall. Nope. This starter deck Yugi Evolution doesn't have it. Okay, maybe my bad. Yeah, I was quite surprised. All right, the clock is counting down. Let's place one card face down in defense mode. Am I lagging out? There we go. Whew. All right, I will enter battle. And I will attack with Gazelle. Yeah, now it's showing it on my screen. Here we go. Oh, oh. Jar of Greed. There we go. 
reconnected. We're good. We're good. <laughs> All good now. All right, main phase two. I got nothing to do in main phase two, so I'm gonna go to my end phase. Your turn. Okay, let's see what we got. Bricked again? Not quite. Oh, oh, Ryukushin. In attack mode. Oh, what is he doing? Are you trying to get rid of my defense monster? You're going for the gamble, hey? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> that blew up in your face. Kind of. Oh, what has he got planned? He says, kind of. One more card face down. Oh. All right, here we go. My turn. Draw. Oh. Okay. I like that. That's that's pretty good. All right, here we go. I am going to summon the giant rat in attack mode. Mm-hmm. Alright, I'm gonna enter battle phase here, and I'm gonna attack with Gazelle. Destroy Ryukushin. And then I'm gonna attack you directly with my giant rat. Literally, it got attacked by a giant rat. His nickname is Grima Wormtongue. <laughs> Tongue. Your turn, Kaba. Okay. Interesting. One card face down, and my turn. Is that all you can do? Yeah, pretty much at this point. <laughs> I thought these car or these decks were built so that they wouldn't be bricky. Uh, it's not so much bricky as uh, when you get an equip card with 700 attack points right off the bat, it is a little tricky to combat. If anything, I'm not dead in uh, one turn, so that's already different from normal Yu-Gi-Oh. Okay, let's set this card. I'm going to summon the Great White attack mode. The one thing I like about these decks is that <laughs> there's not as many responses. <laughs> mm-hmm. All right, I'm gonna attack with the Great White here. Your your face down monster. See, oh, I didn't realize you had a card like that in your deck. Nice. Okay. Yes. Okay. Not to fear though. This is the card that allows the game to drag on. Oh, George and his puns. All right, and I end my turn here. Okay, something good. Come on. Come on, George, you gotta put up a fight. You got swept last time. Thanks for reminding me. <laughs> oh man, he's got all this back row. He hasn't used any of it yet. I wonder what he has. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna activate this. I wanna see what you got. What does that one do again? It says your opponent must keep their hand revealed once per turn during your opponent's standby phase. If they have a spell in their hand, they gain a thousand life points if they have a spell in their hand at resolution. Okay. Oh, okay. That's what you're doing then. Well, that's nice. If the equipped monster attacks, a defense position mo Ooh, inflict piercing battle damage. All right. I'm willing to play that risk just because I'm going to summon the Wall of Illusion in attack mode. You activated my trap card. No! <laughs> oh, Jack deserves. You were waiting to use that. I see what yeah, you did. I was uh, going to use it earlier. I thought, ah, I think it's just going to fill up his board. <laughs> oh, yeah. I, might, I mean, I might as well, right? <laughs> All right. I'm going to attack your face down, monster. Let's see what we got. Mad sword beats for this. Oh, okay, it's piercing battle damage. Alright. And I'm gonna attack you directly. 
Oh. Are you, oh, you're just gonna survive this turn. Just barely. I'm again. 200 life right. points again. Yes. Oh, man. Alright, let's see what you, what you end up drawing. You're gonna have to scoop here, probably. Dark hole, dark hole, dark let's see, hole. Let's see, let's see. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Kaiser Seahorse. Okay, okay. I mean, you're gonna take one card with you. You're up to 1,200 yep. life points now. What oh. will you do? I have something. I could have saved myself 100 life point damage, but whatever. That would just be rubbing salt in the wound at that point. <laughs> All right, let's see what I get here. Oh, you know what? Salt needs to be rubbed into that wound. I play brain control. <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh, oh. Uh, this targets one less. Oh, nice, nice play. Negate the activation if you do destroy a good one. Good play. Too bad though. You're still gonna lose. Well, George, good game. Into the into the second match here. We'll see if you can make a comeback. You're gonna have to win two more I'm sure, I can do it. I won that at least. Oh man, didn't you win the first coin toss too? Yes, I did. But I kind of needed it since I got my ass kicked. Well, at least you're winning because you had something. <laughs> oh, fuck you, me too. <laughs> okay. Alright, let's see, let's see. Alright, alright, alright. Okay, okay, I like this. Good hand, good hand. I play one monster face down defense mode, and then I'm going to play three cards face down before activating card destruction. <laughs> uh, that <laughs> right, was let's, good. let's see what your hand was. Skull, red bird, fissure, gift of the mystical elf. Ooh, okay. Oh man, you had La Jin. Oh, and you have Witch of the Black Forest. Okay, that was a really good one. Yep, you were lucky to have done that. <laughs> How's your new hand? You liking it or <laughs> not really? I like the old hand a little bit better. I'm not gonna <laughs> lie. All right, let's see how you respond. This is this is where uh, we see what your your medal is worth. <laughs> thinking he's thinking yes oh. inner monologue rogue doll all right oh i'm gonna counter with trap hole damn it <laughs> i have to say i got a really good hand kind of because you have one monster on the field in defense mode and two back row now so you're a little bit lacking if something does happen the only person that's allowed to say that I'm lacking is my wife, all right? Let's, ha! let's, let's ha! just get that clear right now. Fair enough. Well, I place another one face down the back row, and I will end my turn. And I will see what you can do. Hmm. Okay. Kojikosi. Kojikosi. All right, I'm gonna allow it. I'm gonna allow it. I'm gonna see what you do here. Oh, love. Okay, one card face down. Enters battle. He goes for the attack. And shadow spell. Balls. <laughs> I probably should have saved it for a different monster, but I'm not quite ready to let you kill my monster just yet. Just yet. Seeing as how I don't have anything to play. Yeah, let's say that might be the uh, issue with this uh, uh, cards you've been having lately. All right, I'm going to activate MST and I'm going to destroy your background card because I don't trust it. Uh, okay. 
Okay, okay. Yeah, that was a good play. That was a good play. I'm gonna end my turn here. Oh, I'll That's take okay. it. I'm thinking that'll help me out later. This has turned into a bit of a chess match, this this, uh, this duel here. Mm-hmm. Sorry, I'm just reading a card I'm not familiar with. <gasps> what do you mean you're not familiar with a card? Yeah, it's I know your own person. deck. <laughs> Okay, let's see what we can do. All right, is this the start of the comeback? Not okay, really. Okay, okay, mysterious puppet T. Each time you or your opponent normal sums or flip sums a monster. Okay. Now have fun with that. I'm going to destroy that newly summoned one. That's what we call a one for one. Sounds good to me. Okay, give me a monster, otherwise I'm oh, <laughs> I'm getting a little bit screwed here. <laughs> Just a little bit. Okay. Uh, yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna set that card. <laughs> uh, uh -oh. I don't quite need Heart of the Cards just yet. I mean, we're, we're still both at 8,000 life points, but uh, mm -hmm. we keep drawing monsters and I keep drawing traps and shit like that, but I'm gonna need it. So far, my back okay. row has been really clutch. Okay, here we go. <laughs> I summon Wing Dragon, Guardian of the Fortress. Crap. Ooh, to attack or not to attack? That is the question. That is definitely a question, I'll give you that. Oh, I'm debating because it's like your monster's not doing anything to hurt me right now, but the longer I leave it there, the more likely it is to be tributed. And so I'm going to enter battle here and I'm going to attack. Yeah, not gonna lie, if you had not attacked me, I'd just been confused on my mind why you hooked into it. Well, it's it's that old school mentality, right? You're, you're, you're trying to play like three turns ahead and sometimes it ends up biting you in the ass because you play you end up playing too cautiously. Hmm. So yeah, I was trying to go for like a big brain play. But now it is your turn. And we will see how you end up responding. Indeed. Okay. All right, Mad Sword Beast. Okay, he's going for the Kamikaze move. Oh shit! You uh, do I have anything there that's really that important? Good to know. That, or I am thinking three steps ahead, and I allowed it. Sure. Just keep telling yourself that. <laughs> All right, all right, here we go. Summon him in defense mode. I will end my turn. Pass it to you, my friend. Sounds good. It looks like your deck is built all around inflicting piercing battle damage, eh? Quite a bit of it. Nobleman of Crossout. Oh, fuck, no. <laughs> oh, it's banished too? Oh, man. Yes. That sucks balls. Alright. Let's see what I get here. Okay. Alright, I like this. Ooh, and it's the, uh, what do you call it, version? Where it's got the silver text. Ooh, shiny. Yeah, here we go. I summon a blade in attack mode. Okay. Let's see what this damn back row has been this whole time. Seven tools of the bandit. Hmm. Yeah, something to defend it. Cost me nothing losing it. Yeah, that's true, but that's geez. true. But uh, I would definitely like to keep that card, so. Alright, I'm gonna attack directly. And then since I have nothing else to play, I will end my turn. Things are just not going well for you, George. Which is no, quite, in, 
stark contrast to how our duels normally go. You normally end up just, like, wiping the floor with me. Alright, what is this? Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. No! Oh, this is not gonna be good. I was gonna say, it doesn't have, like, 1900 attack? What's its effect? Uh, I'm in the blue eyes for my deck. At the start of the damage, you have this card is packs a face down defense position monster, destroy that monster. You can tribute this card, special summon, oh god damn. But it can't attack the turn that I do that, so. Okay. Ooh, okay. Just 100 beating it over. <laughs> But now I summon the legendary Blue Arm Dragon! Oh dear lord. Alright, alright. I'm in for it now. I like how you just ended the sentence of, you know, like, normally whenever we play, you kick my ass. <laughs> what are the odds? Okay, uh, yeah, I'm going to activate brain control. <laughs> nice. And I'm going to take your blue eyes white dragon. And I'm going to summon my giant soldier of stone. <laughs> I'm going to enter battle phase here. And I'm going to attack you with your own blue eyes. And then my giant soldier of stone. So you just rocked my world? Rocked you like a hurricane. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna end my turn. Got my blue eyes back. Yeah, I went a little... Like, it was a bit of a gamble play. We'll see how this ends up going for me. Not well, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> Shit, I was really hoping you weren't gonna summon another monster. All right, heart of the cards, guide me. <laughs> you will need it. Definitely will. Oh, oh. What could he possibly do with one card in his hand and one on the field? Yeah, I'm gonna lose here. <laughs> but I'm gonna take your fucking seahorse with me. <laughs> I'm surprised you didn't do that with my blue eyes originally. I thought about it and I was like, oh, if I can, if I can steal it. I also thought about going to main phase two and hoping that it would go back to you at the end of main phase two, but it went back to you at the end of the turn. If it went yeah. back to you main phase two, then I was gonna destroy it. Mm, so then enough. you wouldn't have any monster, but of course didn't work out that way. So I will end my turn and allow you to obliterate me with white lightning. Excellent. <laughs> Always wanted to say it. Blue eyes. Oh no, wait, wait, down face, down face. Okay, there you go. Blue eyes, white dragon, white lightning attack. Glorious. Alright. We're gonna go <laughs> we're gonna go to a third duel here. We'll see who ends up winning. That's pretty anime happening. That, that made it all there. worth it for you? Exactly. I'm gonna go second this time. Okay, there you go. I'm gonna get the extra draw. Well, at least I won't have to worry about my uh, good hand being sent to the graveyard by card destruction again. Yeah. I mean, hey, good for you that you ended up turning that around because I got off to a pretty healthy start there. Indeed. But nothing can beat blue eyes. Nothing beats blue eyes. Except for, like, every card in the meta nowadays. Wow, you got three back row already. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, I like this, I like this. I'm going to play one card face down. I'm going to play Gazelle, King of Mythical Beasts in attack mode. Okay. Okay, you'll allow it. Oh, oh it. You're gonna allow me to go into battle phase two and attack yeah, your yeah. face down monster? Sure. Oh no, it's Ow. eating. That's off. 
Ah, oh, no. That's okay, I've planned for things like this. I'm five steps ahead of you, Kaiba. Is that all you got? Is that all you got? Is your Kaiser Seahorse? Uh, as of right now, yes. Well, I'm not going to allow that. Okay. I almost forgot for a second that we misread the card and now it's about to hit you. <laughs> I find it funny that it even allowed like the animation to happen. It should have just been like, all right, no, you can't, can't attack. Mm -hmm. But the thing I think says it reduces it to zero, so technically still as an attack. All right. Well, I'm going to resummon my gazelle, King of Mythical Beasts. And then I'm going to equip it with Axe of Despair. Uh, crap baskets. Oh, I thought I did it. Oops. Here we go. Alright, I'm going to enter battle phase here, and I'm going to attack Kaiser Seahorse. Ouch. And with that, I will end my turn. God, I miss the days of foot cards. They were so awesome. Yep. Oof. Card I wanted. Oh, what does this one do? The inexperienced spy. Oh, okay. We'll see what, which one you pick. Oh, okay. Hmm. Huh. Okay. Did you like what you saw? Yeah. I draw. Ooh, good card, good card. This is face down. And then I'm going to summon the monster that you just looked at. The wooden dragon. Guardian of the fortress. Okay. I'm going to enter battle phase here, and I'm going to attack you directly. Yikes. Yeah, this is not going to be pleasant. 3,900 life points in one turn. Yikes. Right. Okay, since your math has struggled the last few duels, this time in the next turn, if you attack me with the same monsters, <laughs> I will. Hey, I was off by not very much, alright? It was like 200 life points. I just got excited. Indeed. Play your last pathetic card. Hmm. Do you have anything or no? Just thinking about it. Summon the Mystic Tomato in attack mode. Mystic Tomato. The Mystic Tomato. What does it do? When this card is destroyed by battle and sent to the graveyard, you can special summon one dark monster. Oh, well, I have to say it's not going to get destroyed by battle, but it is going to get destroyed. Sorry, George. This is the end for you, my friend. Oh. 300, okay. You're gonna get 900 life points here. Hmm. I don't think that's gonna be enough for you to survive next turn, though. Hmm. Got anything else up your sleeve? Nothing I think I'm allowed to do. Alright, here we go, folks. Is this the end for George? Find out next time. No, I'm just joking. <laughs> <laughs> Cut away to commercial. Uh, okay. I am going to summon the giant soldier of stone in attack mode. All right. Rendering battle. And I'm attacking with Gazelle. 
Does it go through? And we control that. No! Okay, okay. Can't do the uh, take control one because it takes. It, it needs to do a sacrifice. Yeah, we need to have a monster. I, I was reading that. I was like, oh god, is he gonna take it and like attack me back? Yeah, and if anything, it's only a one turn thing. Okay. You'll survive this turn. But you will not survive the next. Or will he? It's got 1500 life points. I summoned the card. The Lord of the Deep. Oh, Lord of Dicks, eh? And then I equipped him with Megamorph. Oh no. Okay. Okay. Does that stay on him? Yep. Oh Christ. Oh, that's pretty good. I was going to equip it to my tomato, but then you destroyed my tomato. Decisions. No, I'm gonna let that one go. Because it says the axe of despair says you can tribute one monster. It doesn't say whether it's from your field or from your hand. If it was from my hand, I'd be all game for it. But no, tribute means it's on the field. Yeah, that's kind of what I figured. So I was like, oh, I don't want to do that because I am going to summon the dark magician. Ah, oh, damn it! In attack mode. Nice. All right. Can you feel the? Can you feel it, George? Beginning of the end. Uh, if you have to attack me twice. Oh, I sense a little bit of confidence. Attack! Dark magic attack! Oh my lord, the D. He's in the graveyard, farming all the D's. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, defense mode. Your turn. Do you have a... What do you call it? Do you have um, a man-eater bug in that deck? No. Oh, okay, that's good. I'm going to get rid of... Sort of the demo. I don't want you playing Muster Reborn and getting him back and pulling off a flu summoning dragon bullshit and just destroying <laughs> me, so... <laughs> We're gonna nip that right in the bud. Fair enough. All right, I summon Warrior Die Greffer in attack mode. Hmm. And I'm going to attack with Dark Magician, face down monster. Uh, too bad, I was thinking you were gonna attack with him. I know, I'm not making that mistake again. And here I'm going to attack directly for game. Damn it. Starter Deck Yugi comes out on top both times with Starter Deck Yugi. Deck evolution. That was our duel for today. Tune in next time to see what we play with next. I'm thinking we might play with uh, Starter Deck Pegasus and Starter Deck Joey. Yeah, I think I'd, I'm hoping for um, uh, for a Starter Deck Joey to win, but I can't see that beating a Starter Deck Pegasus in all honesty, but eh, we'll see. Next time on Two Balding Nerds. Until then, we will see you later.